What is up YouTube? Thrift School over here outside the Goodwill. Let's head inside, see what we can find to buy and sell on eBay and Amazon. Let's go. All right, they have video games. We got Rainbow Six Extraction. All oh, this is from Target. All these games right here. Squadrons for $8. A lot of squadrons, holy cow. And then Lego Movie 2, Far Cry 6. I actually might grab a few of these for myself. And then a few to flip. Poyo Poyo. Wow, lots of good games here. Let's see how much they're going for. This is kind of cool. I think it's like a knee board for the back of a boat. It's only five bucks. Hydro Slide Pro. Um, this is pretty cool. Do I take the gamble on it? It's kind of huge. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna look them up, see how they sell locally. Uh, but we'll keep this in mind. I don't think anybody's gonna grab it while I'm here. Hopefully not. I also found a CD uh, right here. The Butterfield Blues Band. Never heard of them, but it's only a dollar. Sells for about 10, 10 after fees. So definitely take it. Ooh, what do we have down here? We have a Magnavox DVD VCR combo with the remote. Yeah, nice. It's very rare that you find these things with remotes. Let's see if it's all corroded. Nope. Oh, and the batteries are good till 2023. So somebody was obviously recently using this thing. 12 bucks. We'll look this up. I'll pop the price up here on the screen for you guys. I'm pretty sure these Magnavox ones do pretty well. Now, I have had times in the past where they don't work fully. Now, you get two days to return things here. So, hey, that's better than nothing. So, maybe we'll take this. I don't know. I don't have a cart. So, I'd have to come back for it. So, I'm down here, obviously, looking at the electronics and the toys. And one thing that kind of stinks now uh, that I just noticed, you could see these things are clearanced from Target. And they're originally $11.99. Target had them down to $3.59. So, Goodwill would normally you know sell it for half price maybe a buck fifty two bucks and they're charging three on all of them so saving 59 cents this one right here 5.99 at target they're charging five you're saving 99 cents uh kind of a shame you would think it'd be a little cheaper than that uh same thing with this roblox super soaker uh, i'm pretty sure these were clearanced at target for 229 i was seeing them there and they're charging five here so definitely uh not the best right here 5.99 this one's three so this is half off that's not bad and what do we have here the all pro passer i've seen these before yeah it has like a little timer on it and it shoots the football 25 dollars that's kind of cool don't think it's worth too much though not much more than 25 anyways all right these are really cool these are vintage big box pc games all brand new sealed all five dollars each and they're all pinball games so this is enigma right here and it's just a weird pinball table this right here is cyborg girl and look at that there's the pinball table right there We have Crash and Burn pinball, pretty neat. And then two deep sea pinballs, pretty neat for five bucks each. I might just snag them all. I'm gonna take a quick look on eBay, make sure that they're not just selling for $5 there. Uh, I have a feeling they might be selling for a bit more. These are just really, really, really cool. I love finding vintage big box PC games sealed like this. I find them semi-regularly, so time to look them up. So I said odds are they'd be going for more than $5 and I was completely wrong. <laughs> They're only selling for about five bucks. So what a shame. They're super cool, but just not worth much. They'd almost be cool for shelf pieces, right? For in a game room. I like them that much, but I just, I don't need them. I don't have space for them. So I actually am leaving them behind. Still pretty cool though. So there we have it. It was a super quick trip. We got the receipt right here. It came to a total of $142 even. And we got lots of games right here. I mean, I'm not gonna quite double up on all of them. This one, I think I'll double up on. Uh, you know, I forgot to look up Far Cry 6. Hopefully that was worth it. You know what, let's look it up together and you guys can see exactly how I do that. Open up my Amazon seller app right here and we will pull up the barcode scanner. There we go. Flip it over and let's hope it's worth it. 
I should have checked. I don't know why I didn't check this one. I just forgot. Let's see. So there it is. Okay, not bad. Uh, I actually sell it for $24.99. So let's say I'm going to sell it for $24.98. And it costs me uh, $12 each plus tax. So let's just say $12.50 or so. I'm gonna make just under $4, so at least I'm not losing money on it. I will take it. So, you know, let's just say about $4 each. There's $8 right there. We have Call of Duty Modern Warfare, which I found last second for 12 bucks. This is actually a great one to find brand new, of course. Even used, it's a good game to find. It sells really fast, it sells for good money. We could scan it in and take a look at this. This $12 game is going to turn into a $44 sale, so I'll make about 20 bucks on that one. So that was a great one. So we're at about $28 right there. And then I got three of these Lego games. So we'll scan this in. I paid $8 each on these. Uh, we're at $28 profit. Each one of these Lego games, I'm going to make $14 on, give or take. So um, was that $6 profit? So 28 plus 6, 12, 18. We are at, oh no, oh no, not good at math. I don't know, somewhere around 50-ish, I don't know. <laughs> and then we have our F1 2021. Let's scan this in, take a quick look. Looks like F1 2021 is selling for, there we go, $30. I'll make 20 on it. I paid 12, so let's just say I'll make about eight bucks on that one right there. So we're around 58 to $60, give or take. This was about $10, so now we're at uh, you know, 68, and then we have all the Maddens. There's two different types of Maddens here. We have the MVP edition and the regular edition. They were all $8, so let's see how many I have of each two MVPs and a bunch of these guys. So let's scan in this one real quick. All right, so this edition of Madden is selling for $20. I'll make 12 bucks on it. I paid eight bucks each, so that's $4 extra. That's four, eight, 12, 16 more dollars. So what are we at, like 80? Now we're at about 90-ish, 95, give or take. And then we have these two right here that I paid $8 for. And we are at... Ooh, these ones are going for $37 Amazon Prime, so I'll make 26 on these. So that is an extra uh, $18 each. We could just round up to 20 to make it easy, so 40. We're well over $100 here, about $120 to $140 in that range. And then we had this Magnavox that I showed you guys what it was selling for. It's over 100 after fees, so we could just slap another $100 on there. I might even be able to charge a little bit more because I have the remote. I have to fully test it. So now we are at, uh, let's just say 120 plus another 120. That's about 240 to $250 after all fees. This stuff will sell super quick. All the games should sell almost instantly and honestly these sell really quick as well this is going to be my longest tail item but it should sell within the month so everything here will be sold real quick it will make about 250 dollars and it took me about 20 minutes so <laughs> definitely worth it highly recommended hope you enjoyed guys this is thrift school signing out see ya